Hello friends, hope you are doing well. Today in this video, we will discuss about how to create configuration file from, uh, from terminal. Well, so first we will trying to use python space odudesk bin like generally it will active the service but right now we are not doing uh, active the service the one more command is dash dash stop after in it this command will help you it will active the odoo service first time and immediately it will stop the execution so here you can see it will stop the execution once it will active uh, this command is used when you want to change something uh, uh, existing configuration file or create a new configuration file that time you can use this command one more command we have to use is minus s s stands for save and uh, this command will create new configuration file if we don't give any configuration file path or update existing configuration file using minus s command then after uh, and yeah one more thing is there is no any other parameter we have to use for minus s command another command is if you want to give specific uh, configuration file name we can use minus c space odoo underscore conf config dot conf here you have to remember is here you can give whatever file name but the dot conf extension must be the same otherwise uh, while active the odoo service it will not recognize the configuration so let's first check in our current directory there is no any file like odoo underscore config underscore dot conf there is nothing here now we are trying to use uh, create one configuration file stop after init then after minus e odoo cunf config dot cunf press enter key it will stop again we will see here ls here you can see this is this configuration file created by odoo so here you can see first like what look like inside uh, those are the commands and those are used by default if you don't specify this uh, configuration file name so here you can see database is false it means uh, all list of databases you can see from front end side but uh, the question is like if you want to update existing uh, configuration file then what to do the same step you need to follow like here uh, but here minus c we have to we must have to use another thing is this file exists in current directory or any specific directory then after like we will try to rename the database uh, database test press enter key let's check the configuration file and here you can see previously it was false but now it's it's a test so whenever you will use this configuration file by default it will load only test database so if you want to use uh, active the service using this command uh, using this configuration file then uh, you have to use minus c then after odoo underscore config dot conf extension file press enter key it will active by default the same port number and all but once you will refresh this page it will active i will go to terminal and you can see here those logs so i hope you enjoy this video and see you in next video